there, friends. I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Alita Loresco with a look at your one minute weather. Heat advisories remain intact across southeast Texas with heat index values anywhere between 108 to 112 degrees this afternoon. We do have some relief though on the way. Look for temperature readings to once again top out right around 100 degrees in the Houston area. So away from the coastline is where you'll see some of the highest temperatures along the coast in the low 90s. The record to tie today at Bush Airport is 102 for now. It does look like uh, that record could be safe. 104 today in San Angelo. Meanwhile, we'll see a front moving into the northern parts of our state. That front will eventually move closer towards southeast Texas this weekend, also delivering some much needed rain. It will be widely scattered and still some low rain chances, but there will be a few lucky folks that will see a few cooling downpours. Right now, it looks like that front may bring about a 30% chance of showers late in the afternoon into the evening on Saturday. But as we go into Sunday, looking for some heavy rain to move from the Lake Charles area toward I-45. So impacting some of your afternoon plans on Sunday as those showers and thunderstorms lift off to the west by Sunday evening. Still about a 10% chance or 20% chance you might encounter a shower or two. Monday into Tuesday. Measurable rain uh, situated basically across our area, but higher rainfall totals further off toward the east. Rainfall totals uh, at least through the next seven days, ranging from a tenth of an inch to maybe a half an inch of rain. Beyond the weekend, we are looking at a thick plume of Saharan dust. It could be the thickest concentration we've seen so far this season, and this is going to impact us for much of next week. So once the rain showers dry up, we are going to be dealing with more hot and dry conditions along with that dusty air that could have impacts for those of you allergy and asthma sufferers. We will continue to keep you posted. All right, that's a look at your forecast on this Thursday. Thanks for watching.